Welcome to Big Bear Trailers and Outdoor in Outdoor Northamptonshire. Today we've got a review for you on the Debon C300 box trailer. Um, this one is one that's fresh from the factory and pretty much this is standard spec for us. So we typically go for aluminium planking and this is a double skin with a cavity in the middle which is really great. Comes with a five year guarantee on the aluminium planking. Also side personnel door, again we tend to specify them with the door on the UK near side. We can specify them on the off side if you'd prefer. If I come out of the way for a minute, Kate can just show you some pictures of the trailer. Um, they come in different colours, this one's obviously black front and roof. They also come in dark grey, light grey, white and burgundy. Technical spec on the trailer, gross weight of 1300 kilograms. Empty weight is 510, so you've got a load carrying capacity of 790 kilograms. Internal rectangular floor space here. You have an internal dimension of 268 centimetres long, 152 centimetres wide, and then you do also have the dome section at the front there as well. Let me come back into shot and I'll just show you some of the key features. So personnel door has a lock both top and bottom. Um, to open it, just push in at the top, rotate forward, do the same on both. It does have a little sucker pad, but we've just got to watch out for windy days. Um, so that can hold that back. We'll open it up inside. This one's got a spare wheel. It comes to us with a spare wheel on a stand, but loose. Typically, that's where we would mount it, but I'll show you a bit more detail on that when we get inside, so you can see that in a bit more detail. Prop stands are standard, so really nice because it's single axle. If you're loading and unloading, whether you be attached to the vehicle or not, so we just release that clamp, lower that down. For today, because it's only me, I'm just going to put the one down. At the rear, we've got the full width rear ramp that also opens the barn door. Let me show you it as a ramp to start with. So just open that, open this side, pull that down, and we can also then open up the top flap as well. So the bit I like to point out is because of the suspension on this trailer, which is a coil spring with a shock absorber, the ride is superb and it really handles empty the same as it does loaded as well. So really nice and smooth. As a result of the suspension though as well, you get a really shallow ramp angle. So nice and easy to roll things up. And if I come into here, basically I'm six foot six tall, so I can stand up inside here. You have got the slight lip on entry, but great when you're inside. I say standard trailer, so phenolonic board floor, two tie down points on each side, each of which are rated to 250 kg for each one. Typically that's where we would mount the spare wheel, but we don't have to fit it, we can also fit it off to one side. But the nice thing is if it sits there, it's not protruding into that rectangular floor space dimensions I talked to you about. So really handy. Then if I come back out, oh sorry, just pointing out, we've also got an internal light here. So if you're attached to the tow vehicle with the tow vehicle's lights on, you can switch that internal light on and off as well. So also, as I say, this really ramp also opens as a barn door. So let me just take it back to the closed position, which is latched on both sides. Then if I want to open it as a barn door, just undo this one. And also come down here, just undo the pin, pull that out that's then ready to open as a barn door as well. The only thing we say we do need to watch out for here is it's a big solid sail so on a windy day please be careful because if you were to let go of it it's a little bit gusty here today but I'm not going to let go of it because it could slam. Nice and easy then to bring it back in just bring it back in close that to close it there pop the pin back in here and that is ready to either go on the move or open up again. Some customers do want to transport quite longer items in. You can and we have, and I have, travelled with the ramp shut but that top flap open so you've got items protruding out there if you ever needed to. I'll leave that open for now but normally we'd close that down first of all before bringing the ramp in to close that. Then if we just wander forward again, just a couple more bits to show you. If I close the door, So I just wanted to show you were auto lift jockey wheel. Um, if you're used to trailers, you're used to how you have to wind up, then lift it up and clamp it off and remember to clamp it tight enough and it always comes loose. With this one, basically, if I come the other side, excuse my back, if Kate comes in a bit closer, we can see when you wind this, that vertical pin comes up, hits the collar, 
basically what happens with the wheel it comes up and folds up against the stem post there so really nice and easy to use 13 pin electrics also when you're hitching up when you're lowering the hitch onto a trailer you don't need to touch the hitch handle at all it will click down on its own the only time you do need to come in is when you're releasing the trailer off of the tow ball that's pretty much it stunning looking trailer um, really nice and aerodynamic suspension is superb so they handle really well aluminium planking so really practical you can do things like cargo rails if you wanted to on the inside but leaving all the looks of the trailer on the outside we do lots of these typically hundreds for motorbikes um, karting all that sort of activity but as a general purpose trailer they're also superb if we can help at all please do give us a call our number here is 01832 770 my name's Ian but either myself or the team will be very happy to help you um, or you can take a look on our website which is www.bigbeartrailers.co.uk thanks again for your time bye now